Alright guys, welcome back to Hearts of Iron Dog M here and we are shortly in front of what we've been dreaming of <laughs> for the longest time here in this playthrough. We wanted to conquer England, that was our plan from the beginning and it, you know, we had a little distraction called Russia conquered them all, turned them into a fascist state which are supporting us now and the Axis is strong right now, we're in in there with the nationalist Rus Russians, um, Italy, Japan and right now it seems the Axis is really really doing work holy moly we are taking England by storm at the moment it really seems like the British are running out of resources they cannot feed their war machine anymore and um, we're really making fast advancements now I almost was thinking, man, this is this whole invasion was a flop um, and we were at the brink of being pushed out of the island again but then we somehow managed you know, with clever management to, to stay on here and now we are really, really, really doing it to them. Okay, we have air support here. We soon need to Assign everything that can reach to over here. It's not much. Probably should. As 1,200, we should. Let's get some more. Let's get some more. Let's get some close air support in here. Yeah. We're getting new, new airports. It's all ours. 2,000. It's a good one. Okay. Let's pause real quick. Mm, what is our fighter situation? Yeah, we don't really have many fighters anymore. But let's get a thousand close air support guys here. Tell them to operate here. And um, yeah, you try to gain air superiority and you bomb divisions as soon as you're here. Okay. Let's go back to the strategic map where we really, really, really getting the English in trouble. I mean, there is a strong US battalion again. We're really getting close to London here, guys. Really getting close to London. Um, okay, let's assign a new task to Rommel. He's our MVP in this whole war. Let's try to get this chunk of them. They have some strong divisions sitting here. Rommel, do your thing. Just do your thing. Did London just fall? I'm thinking there should be a message. Like, isn't London somewhere in here? Where is London? Can't see, there's too much action going on. Wow. Now... Now shit just got real, man. We are we are doing it, man. Can't believe it. Getting some air support here as well. The Luftwaffe, German Air Force. It's a little auto safe there. Shifting some troops around. They are having attrition issues. Wow. Yep, there is London, there is London. We're attacking it, there's a Brazilian force in London. We're pushing the Americans away. Did they bail? Where is all these Americans? There's 30, 73 British forces here, there's, they're redeploying. I mean, I think they're pulling troops back from, from all over the world, I would assume. What is the supply situation? Perfect. Very good. We're overpowering them. We're simply overpowering them right now. Let's march in here, man. Take it. Take it. Cut them off. Oh, wow. <laughs> Fog of war everywhere. Can't really tell what's going on anymore. Yeah, they have some, some troops down there. 
how is the oh man they've almost given up wow okay Rommel did a great job there again taking more land let's tell him to snag this Inferior enemy, some divisions not in position yet. Yeah, 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 I get it, I get it, I understand. Ormel. But you have to do it anyways. You have to do it anyways. This is the final final assault. I'm feeling they should have they have attrition like crazy. They surely have attrition. These troops are still strong though, but they could lose Ah, oh, they pushed back again push this back again there dang it breaking out Rommel take their take their stuff flood out it's doing it here we're counter attacking again yeah oh wow they're falling we took London we took London pushed them here in a corner we got them encircled let's keep him there can't get out of that oh wow it's happening guys, it's happening! What is the the war score? 90% towards capitulation. Yeah, they got some... Dover, we need to get Dover, that is... They're defending that with all they have, but we just gonna starve them. They are, they are sitting in there, they can't... Can't get no supplies, no nothing, we just gonna hold them there. And with the rest of our troops we gonna... We're gonna march. March. Go, guys. Yes. Push them in the corner. Isolate them. If we take Dover, I, um, it should be over. <laughs> uh, that was a rhyme. Dropping those rhymes. Let's take Dover. It should be over. <laughs> okay. Counter attack. They also they should have pretty bad attrition. Sixteen percent, six percent, nine percent attrition. Wow. Counter attack. Counter attack. Jeez, man. Get them. Get them. Yes. Oh, wow. Also, they're losing all their airports here, obviously. So they cannot do much of their planes anymore to stop us. Get like a ton of them caught in the corner there. That's fine. Okay. Let's reorganize our battle front, our battle lines a little bit. Get Rommel away from there. We don't really need him there. We want him to be all over there. Let's do a little switcheroo here. Let's contain them there, that we should be able to do that. They have a port, so they can bail. The attrition on them should be severe though. And now we're gonna tell Rommel to do this. Get in position. Take one side after the other. Yeah, if they're sabotaging factories, we don't care. So, okay, let's look at the war score. Yeah, 93. I think if you take Dover, it's over. Like, literally. Okay. Is Rommel ready? They're getting some supplies here, but attrition is real. Rommel, do your thing. Attack. Get in there. Ooh, that was quick. I think they bailed. They ran away. What's the war score now? They gave up. 
They gave up. They have capitulated. I can't believe it. And now we still need... Uh, we got the Americans now as the leader of the Allied forces pretty much, right? Yeah. That's gonna be another story, man. Getting over to the United States and invade that place. Oh. Now we need to clear out these armies there, though. Let's get Rommel. You, Rommel was kicking ass, like, this whole Let's Play. Like, seriously. Like, wow. Let's unleash him. Get in there, yeah, yeah, yeah. You are unleashed. Get in there. Hommel, get going. Let's destroy them. It's Australian troops and a lot of Americans. Took it all. This belongs to us. Why is Northern Ireland though? Why didn't we get this? Wow! We conquered English mainland. Let's have a look at the world map right now. What's happening here? Yep. The Italians are pretty much destroying their last remaining troops. Here, the Americans are having serious serious issues of holding Jap Japan back. Well, it's gonna be tough to get over there. I mean, we have to probably go via then, you know. Yeah, Iceland, Greenland, and then there, because the direct route over the channel will be tough. We like over the North Atlantic, just right there that is impossible and it's huge it's gonna be another russian situation <laughs> where things like take forever but first of all i think we should clear ireland so <coughs> let's give rommel uh, an order from here to there there should be not much navy around i i was i would hope you go from here to there. And yeah, get a bridgehead here in Belfast. And you just ride to London and enjoy enjoy life a bit there, I guess. Wow. <laughs> UK gave up. Yeah, I mean now with their center of command gone. There's British Raj still. But I feel... Yeah, I mean, they, they should be overpowered here. Should be overpowered. Crazy. I mean, New Zealand is in there still, but that's a minor faction. I wouldn't say that is a big contributor. The United States contributed a lot, but they also lost a lot of people by now, like six million. We also have seven atomic bombs, I'm just realizing. Wow, Canada is still there, free American empire. Can we, don't they want peace, man? Like, they are fascists too. Offer peace. They will not accept. Uh, we need to at least one more positive than negative reason for an acceptance. We currently have minus 20. What? What would be a positive for them to accept it? You are not war leader for the losing side. What? Ah, okay. War score in favor for winning side must be at least 50. Currently 41. Okay. 
they would also end the war, just offer them peace and, you know, they're fascists after all. Mm -hmm. but we might have to f go over there and attack him. Let's try to get some more war score here, I, I suppose. His troops are getting ready. Should have air superiority there, right? I mean, yeah, we can just tell some some fighters to go there. Okay. Yeah, let's send some. Wait. No air wings in range. What the? We should be able to fly there, right? But can't I? Really? Not? We should have some stuff that could make it to the western approaches, of course. Yeah. I mean, of course said there was none in reach, it's some complete bullshit. Some English troops are sitting over here, it's their last resort, Ireland, pretty much have nothing. Okay, we also need to do some suppression over here now, obviously they don't like to be invaded by us, so it's pretty much covered everything anti-suppression, get some forces over here, get the situation under control, don't want that much damages, yeah that's all broken and destroyed, but we have so many factories now, we gained like a ton of factories, yep, now we can also quietly refill our troops, everything is looking fine, well if the Americans would have not entered, we would have won this war. Right? I mean, it would be over. They should be on our side. Don't understand it how... Normally, if they turn fascist, they should uh, say, hey, we, you know, we're out of the war. I mean, I don't know what to do about it. We Can we do anything on... I mean, they're super... Super fascist, pretty much. 63%. There's gonna be no elections. We cannot stage a coup. It sucks so much. It should be on our side. That, that really doesn't make no sense. I mean, you know. It's really strange. In my opinion, like they were in the war. And we staged the coup then, eventually they turned fascist. They should then say, alright, um, we're not gonna fight our fascist brothers, uh, so to speak. You know, we, we wanna, like, we drop out of that war or something. That would be a normal reaction, I would assume. Still have a bunch of troops sitting over there, right? Yeah, they have no commander assigned, nothing. But it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, now it's just um, getting over to Ireland and grab that too. That should be an easy, easy approach as soon as we have the invasion force ready. I mean, we're how long will it take? Yeah, we're almost there. Let's speed up the time a bit. Mm, don't think, don't think the Americans can can do much right now. There's don't see them here, close to England. Now there's the coop. Where? Where? British Raj? Nepal? Where? Where did the coup happen? <laughs> Can't really see that happening. Ireland, United Kingdom, is that? Oh. Well, now it's too late for a coup. 
We don't really need that. Okay. Yeah, before we end this episode, we definitely wanna wanna get Ireland occupied. That is a must. So forty five days. Okay. Let it run, let it run, let it run. The days go by. Very nice. Some Americans sitting there. What is that island even? Okay. Along some northern island there. Can't really walk there, right? You would have to do a naval invasion too. Uh, that sucks. Okay. Yeah, the Americans are awaiting us here. Do they know that we're gonna land up here? They seem to almost have posi positioned themselves in a way that they can intercept us there. Man, well, let's get some let's get some tank busting going. Let's tag them a bit. have no attrition as well there oh, there was some ships 3000 airplanes just destroyed them oh wow okay we're almost there so we can get this done F go over should probably Yeah, we are attacking ships here too. It's all right. Good. In case there's some ships around. Okay, how many days? Three days. Three days and we can ride over there. What a campaign, man. This is the most epic campaign ever. Like, it's such a crazy crazy game okay um, I'm rolling out and start invading I'd say there should be no ships right I mean you can't even imagine it's like we were flying around here bombing the heck out of everything for the longest time now okay we landed we landed oh we got them encircled let's go they bailing. I saw some ships rolling out. Literally. I think they're running away. Mm -hmm. Battle of Belfast. It's gonna be a tough nut to crack. Actually. Let's assign a battle plan. We have attrition here. So let's contain them with the tanks. Let's get rid of that, let's get rid of that, let's get rid of that. Get Rommel and his tanks to do the encirclement with the other troops. Gonna do a, a front line here, and then we're gonna give them a plan to pretty much take that all. Right? Okay. Are they going into position? I hope. And Rommel also needs a battle plan. It's like swoop in there, pretty much. Get in position. What are they saying? Same division, some divisions now in position, yeah, we get that, we understand. And he's saying risky, division's still preparing, okay. I mean, you can go, I mean, that is, there is nothing. Oh, yeah, okay, well, not really, but there's the timer. Let's 
Let's get that invasion going, right? I mean, we need land, we need supplies here. Then I didn't think British Empire was annexed. Then took one state, British Empire was annexed. Where was that? Okay, that's that's uh, the coup situation we had going on. Nobody knows where. Uh, they're holding on to the ports here, which is bad. They're getting their supply through that. Mm -hmm. It's actually not such a nice situation for us on this island here. We need to we need to concentrate on, on getting them for real. We need to get them to go away. We need to stop that plan. We need to assign most... We need another battle line here. And we need to assign most of those guys to, to this. South Africa has capitulated. Nice. That's, that's good. Okay, now they're getting some attrition too. That's neat. Let's get rid of those battle plans here for now. Let's just uh, get one here. And yeah, let's execute. Let's execute that. We need that port. We need, dearly need that port. They were smart, occupying both ports. Let's see if we will be able to take that from them. They're having attrition too, but way less bad than we. Nah, it's, it's all bad. All pretty bad. <clears throat> yep. They are getting no supplies over here. And they are sitting on a honey pot right at the port. Is there another port? There's one down there. Could we maybe make it to there? Maybe, maybe, we might need to prepare another invasion force and come down here, right? I mean, we have these guys there, we just pull them down here, and then try to get to the port. I was hoping I could overrun them here, but it sure didn't work. It could be costly, we have to hold on there. We have air superiority here, but it's like, can their convoys even make it to here? It's like, we don't know. Well, we find out next episode. We have to, we have to get in there, get this port here, so we can actually get some supplies onto Ireland. And um, yeah, that should be fine. Hope you enjoyed. See you next time, my friends. Oh wait, wait. We have, we have these forty-two troops here too. Wait, let's yeah, let's let let's get them here. And um Are they bailing? Saw a destroyer there. Sure sinking some of their ships. Yeah, yeah. British are losing a lot. Yeah. Just need to contain him here. And that's all we can do for now. Hope they don't try to really attack us. Get get these troops over there. Don't have a bridgehead anywhere, sadly. So yeah. Now you stay here. You prepare a naval invasion from here to there. And then work your way up, connect what we have, how long will it take? How long will it take to get that up and red? 
They destroyed our units there. God dang it. How annoying can it be? <sighs> yeah, we pretty much starved to death on that dang island. Ah, that did hurt. That did hurt. That also calls for horrible revenge. Yeah, let's train some panzer divisions. Um, can we? No, we can't. Oh man, I was hoping I could cut them off and it totally failed. That did hurt. Okay. And it should be fine. 627. Let's make a few. Let them get ready. Pretty much have all equipment there. And um, we should be fine. That sucked. That really sucked. Oh well. See you next time I'm out. Bye guys.